Did you know video series from the National Cancer Institute, Testicular Cancer? Did you know that testicular cancer is most frequently diagnosed among men aged 20 to 34? Half of new cases occur in this age group. The median age at diagnosis is 33. Compared with other cancers, testicular cancer is rare. It is the 24th most common cancer in the United States. However, more than 9,000 men are diagnosed with this cancer each year. Although men can develop testicular cancer at any time during their life, less than 3% of new cases are diagnosed in men over the age of 65. The five-year relative survival rate for testicular cancer is 95%. This means that out of every 100 men diagnosed with testicular cancer, about 95 have not died from their cancer five years after diagnosis, after adjusting for other causes of death. White men are most likely to develop testicular cancer, followed by American Indian and Alaska Native, Hispanic, Asian and Pacific Islander, and black men. The risk of developing testicular cancer among white men is more than four times that among black men and more than three times that among Asian and Pacific Islander men. Testicular cancer can occur in one or both testicles. The testicles are also sometimes called testes or testis if referring to one testicle. Nearly all testicular cancers start in germ cells, which are the cells that make sperm. There are two main types of testicular germ cell cancers, seminomas and non-seminomas. They grow and respond to treatment differently. Testicular cancer is usually found by men themselves, either by chance or during a self-exam. Sometimes the cancer is found by a doctor during a routine physical exam. Although there is no routine screening test for testicular cancer, it can usually be cured Finding it early may make it easier to treat. Symptoms of testicular cancer include a lump or swelling in either testicle, a change in how the testicle feels, an ache in the lower abdomen or groin, sudden buildup of fluid in the scrotum, or pain and discomfort in the testicles or scrotum. However, conditions other than testicular cancer may be causing these symptoms. Certain factors, such as having an undescended testicle, having abnormal development of the testicles, having a personal history of testicular cancer, or having a family history of this disease, especially a father or brother, may increase the likelihood of developing testicular cancer. Treating testicular cancer can cause infertility by decreasing the amount of sperm made by the body. Changes in fertility may be temporary or permanent, so some men may choose to store their sperm before beginning treatment. It is important to talk with your doctor about fertility and cancer treatment. Talk with your doctor or someone you trust, such as a parent, coach, or significant other, if you are experiencing any of the symptoms covered in this video, since they are warning signs of possible testicular cancer. Also, talk with your doctor if you have questions about your risk. For clear and accurate answers to your questions about testicular cancer, visit cancer.gov or call 1-800-4-CANCER to connect with specialists from NCI's contact center. For more cancer statistics, go to seer.cancer.gov. U.S. Department of Health and Human Services, National Institutes of Health, National Cancer Institute. Produced September 2020.